Welcome Aries to messages from your special person, love tower reading. For those of you that are new and joining us, welcome guys. And for those of you returning, welcome back and thanks for all of your support. So as always, the reading here is going to be a general tarot spread. So please just take what resonates with you and discard the rest. Or perhaps you may be interested in a personal tarot reading with me. If so, please feel free to inquire. I will list my email address just below the video here where the show more section is along with all the different types of readings that I offer. So the spread that we're going to do today, oh my goodness, <laughs> sorry about that, just bumping things here. The spread that we're going to be doing here today, Aries, is intended for you guys, for Aries Ascendants, Sun, Moon, Venus and Rising, and of course for those of you that are cross-watching. So let's take a look at uh, the incoming messages from a special someone here. What is it that they want to um, let you know? You've got the Ace of Cups, the World card, the Four of Wands, the Ace of Wands, the Lovers card, and the Hierophant. Okay, these are a beautiful combination of uh, tarot cards here, Aries. Um, Okay, so overall this person is feeling pretty optimistic and very um, happy, very satisfied with the connection and, you know, with uh, what the two of you have going on. The Ace of Cups and the Lovers card here, I feel like speaks uh, speaks to us of, the, of this person falling in love with you or falling in love with you all over again. Um, or perhaps this person is falling for you, or their feelings for you are blossoming here, okay? They're catching feelings here. Um, they're developing romantic feelings from what I can see. Um, this person here, okay, I feel like, yeah, this is someone really into you, and this is someone who... I feel like the cards here hint at them wanting to... Um, like them wanting to establish a future with you. This is someone who I feel like you mean the world to them. You're everything to them here, Aries. Um, and this is someone who sees you in their future. They may not have necessarily opened up um, and um, have told you this. But this is someone who I feel like wants... Um, uh, they pro they possibly want to marry you here, or they you know uh, they want to move in with you here. This is someone who wants to build a life with you here. With the Ace of Cups, I feel like this person is wanting to come in with an uh, a love offer. They want you to know just how much um, they feel for you already. Even if it is something just um, something new that might have started out recently, I feel like this person may already be uh, falling for you. Yeah, I just feel like the intensity of this connection is uh, full on, okay? With the Lovers card, this person does feel like you could be a soulmate. You could be their soulmate, their soul partner. Um, uh, this could be a soulmate connection here that they're feeling, okay? They do seem they're a little overwhelmed here. Uh, for some of them, I feel like this person... Like, you've definitely sparked a romantic interest in this person, but it feels as though maybe they didn't necessarily expect to be falling for you as hard as they're falling for you here, Aries. So it seems that with the Ace of Cups, these emotions to them uh, may be foreign or just maybe um, in general really overwhelming and it may be consuming, uh, consuming them. I get a sense that, yeah, this is someone whom... They want you. They want you to be a part of their life. They want to build a life with you. I feel like this person feels very good about the connection here. They feel very optimistic. They feel very joyful. Uh, they feel a very strong, intense connection with you. It's almost like, you know, they want to... They want to ask if you feel the same way, but I don't feel like they need to because they're almost confident that what they feel, you feel for them as well. So they are wanting, this is someone who wants commitment, who wants a relationship, who wants something long term. I feel like this is someone who wants a future with you, who wants, um, I feel like, yeah, they possibly, for some of you, I feel like this person wants to come in with a proposal, okay, a marriage proposal. They want to offer you their love, they want to offer you their heart here. They're coming in with some sort of love offer. 
for others of you, I feel like this person wants to um, drop the el the album, okay? They, they want to open up to you emotionally and they want to express to you the, the emotions that they're feeling here. It could be someone, um, Aries, this could be someone whom you could be reuniting with, okay? This could be someone from your past, like a past lover whom you um, may be, you know, revisiting a connection with. And if so, I feel like this person, the second time around, I feel like they might have made their mistakes and they might have let you go the first time around. But the second time around, it looks like this person is here to stay and they want something long term and something solid with you here. It's not that they're holding, they're not holding back emotionally, but I feel like it's just they're scared to overwhelm you because I feel like. You know, they're starting to develop these feelings early on or they're starting to fall in love with you all over again here for some of you. And basically they're scared to overwhelm you. They don't want to push you or drive you away. So it seems as though they're waiting. They're biding their time here and they're waiting for the right time. Okay, this is yeah, someone who wants to come in and declare their love to you. They want to um, tell you, you know, what's been going on with them emotionally and that this person sees you in their life. So for a lot of you, I feel like, yeah, there is a, a, a love offer of some sort coming in from this person. It's just, it seems as though they're waiting for the right set of circumstances or the right time to open up here to you. They want, they want a relationship. They want a commitment here. They want something stable with you, okay? They want to lock it down here. They want to seal the deal. And they will. Okay, they, they will um, open up. They will open up. They're not afraid to love here. They've got a lot of love to give and they're going to flow it all towards you here from what I can see. But I just feel like it's almost like, you know, they're waiting. I get a sense that this person is waiting for the right time or they're waiting um, for the right circumstances to do just that. Okay, Aries. Um, and that is your spread. So as always, guys, thank you for watching and for listening. Please um, show your support by subscribing to this channel, by liking, sharing or commenting below. For those of you that would like a personal tarot reading with me, feel free to inquire. Otherwise, take care, guys, and I will catch up with you later in the week.